Hello friends, this video on application of integrals part 5 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 4. In this question, we have to find the area of the smaller part of the circle x square plus a square x square plus y square is equal to a square. That is circle with center 0, 0 and radius a cut off by the line x is equal to a by root. That is x is equal to some constant. So let's draw this. I have my circle with my center 0, 0 and I have this line, let's suppose. So in this case, if you see, this guy is my 0, 0. This guy will be what? x will be a, y will be 0. Why? Because my center is 0, 0 and radius is a. And this guy I am told is x is equal to a root 2. Some constant, right? So this guy will be my a root 2 comma. Now the question says I have to find the smaller part. Which one is smaller? This guy is this guy. See, a by root 2 is nothing but 0.7a. So this guy is 0.7a and this guy is 0.3a. Obviously 0.7a will give you more area. Also this guy is more, if you see right, this guy is more. This is the bigger area, the smaller area. So I am looking into this guy. Why? Because the area of the this line cut by see I am looking at which area I'll tell you why first this line correct then this curve so if you see this area see the whole curve is divided by this line into two half one is this guy this area and this area I am asked to find a small area, that is I am looking into this area, the one with the stars. Please understand, since there are very less number of lines involved, so you get big big areas here actually. You see there is a circle and you have this line, this divides into two area, this guy, area with this arrow mark, this area, whole area and the area with the stars. I am asked to find a small area, obviously this guy is smaller, correct. Now to find this. I can even if I find this one area, I can just multiply into two because by symmetry both are equal. Correct. So I can say that uh, let's suppose this I mark it as with with uh, dots. With dots. So I can say that required area is nothing but two into area of dotted region. Why? If you see, this is the area with dotted region, this is the area with star region, or the whole area is the star region actually, and that's what we are looking for. And the area with dotted region is this guy. So that is equal to this guy area. So if I find the area of dotted region, if you multiply by 2, you get this star area region. That's what we are looking for. So now to find dotted area region, we can do a simple thing. If I vary with respect to x, I can do it. I can they are vary with respect to y also, but for that I have to find this point, which I don't know. And why should I spend time? Because in this case I know the x varies from a root to 2a. So let's use dx only. So my area is nothing but 2 into integration of y dot dx and x varies from a root to 2 a. Correct. And what is the value of y? Y is this curve. So my y x square plus y square is equal to a square. So with this I get y square is equal to a square minus x square. Or y is nothing but root of a square minus x square. So let's put the value. This is nothing but 2 a root 2 say a root of a square minus x square dx. And this if you solve this is nothing but 2 this becomes x by 2 root a square minus x square plus a square by 2 sine inverse x by a from a by root 2 actually. This is not a root 2, a by root 2. x equal to a by root 2. So a by root 2. Please note it's all a by root 2. a by root 2 to a. Correct? Because it's a by root 2. This is what you have to solve. So if you solve this, this guy becomes 2 into x equal to a, a by 2 root a square minus a square plus 
ए स्क्वायर बाई टू साइन इनवर्स ए बाय ए माइनस एक्स इक्वल टू ए बाय रूट टू इन क्यू टू रूट ए स्क्वायर माइनस ए स्क्वायर बाय टू प्लस ए स्क्वायर बाय टू साइन इनवर्स ए बाय रूट टू बाय ए करेक्ट दिस बिकम जीरो सो दिस बिकम टू ए स्क्वायर बाय टू साइन इनवर्स माइनस पाई बाय टू माइनस ए बाय टू रूट टू इन टू दिस बिकम्स ए स्क्वायर माइनस ए स्क्वायर बाय टू दैट इज ए स्क्वायर बाय टू रूट दैट इज ए बाय रूट टू प्लस ए स्क्वायर बाय टू साइन इनवर्स दिस गेज कैंसिल साइन इनवर्स वन बाय रूट टू इज पाई बाय फोर पाई बाय फोर सो इफ यू सी दिस गाइज नथिंग बट इफ यू टेक टू ए स्क्वायर कॉमन टू ऑल्सो इज कॉमन एक्चुअली इफ यू सी टू ए स्क्वायर कॉमन एंड यू टेक फोर ऑल्सो कॉमन हेयर सो दिस बिकम्स ए पाई माइनस वन माइनस पाई बाई टू सो दिस बिकम्स दिस कैंसल दिस बिकम्स ए स्क्वायर बाई टू फाइव बाई टू माइनस जस्ट कैलकुलेशन एंड दैट्स वॉट यू कैन एंस द द मेन कॉन्सेप्ट वॉज to find that to understand that we are talking about this area this area and this big area is nothing but 2 into the area of dot integration and this then is just the integration part involved and we have done a lot of questions in the past chapter how to integrate this and that is not that difficult let's take one more example here the question is a little different here we need not find the area here we have to find the value of a for which we have some conditions so i'll show you the area between this curve y is equal to x equal to y square and x equal to 4 is divided into two equal part by this line x equal to a we to find the value of a that is we have this curve and then we have this line so if you see this guy is some line x equal to a we don't know and this guy line is x equal to 4 if you show this guy is 0 1 2 3 4 I just took this line x will do it because I don't know where is the value of a somewhere I took and then we have this line x will do four with the question says the area between this curve and this if you see what is the area between this curve and this I'll draw in blue this guy this guy and this guy. This is the area between this curve x is equal to y square and this line x equal to four. Now the question says this area is divided into two equal part by line x equal to a. That means there is a line x equal to a, the green line. This divides into two equal area. So if you see the question says if you take this line now, this guy is area one with star as correct, and then I have area two. Let's suppose with dots. This guy is a one, and this guy is a two. The question says a one is equal to a two. These two areas are same. We have to find the value of a. So let's do one thing. If a one is equal to a two by symmetry, we cannot find the whole area. We, if we again just find this area also, this area, we equate this area also. It's all same because. This guy is equal to this guy. This guy is equal to this guy, right? So instead of equating this big big area, if we can equate this guy, this small area, and this small area, and we are assuming that guy is even by two, and this guy is also even by two, correct? Because this whole thing is even, this whole thing is a two. So even by two is this area, and even a two by two is this area. If even by two, even is equal to a two, that is implies that even by two has to be equal to a two by two. So what is a one by two? This area. So let's find a one by two. Integration of y dot dx. Here my x is varying from zero to a. This point is a. X is varying from zero to a. Correct. Zero to a. And what is the value of y? Y is nothing but root x. Correct. Y is equal to root x because x equal to y square. So this becomes integration of zero to a root x dx, and 
and that is nothing but x to the power 3 by 2 0 to a by 3 by 2 this is nothing but 2 by 3 a to the power 2 by 3 that is what I got a1 by 2 let's find a2 by 2 here also a2 by 2 is this area y dot dx here y is varying x is varying from a to 4 a to same thing same curve a to 4 root x dx that is x to the power 3 by 2 by 3 by 2 a to 4 so if you solve this this guy is nothing but 2 by 3 common you get 4 to the power 3 by 2 minus a to the power 3 by 2 4 to the power 3 by 2 is nothing but 2 to the power 3 that is 8 that is 2 by 3 into 8 minus 8 to the power 3 by 2. Now you are saying that these guys are same a1 by 2 is equal to a2 by 2. So a1 by 2 is equal to a2 by 2. What is a1 by 2? 2 by 3 a to the power 2 by 3. What is a2 by 2? This guy 2 by 3 8 minus a to the power 3 by 2. Correct. 3 by 2 actually. 8 to the power 3 by 2. 2 by 3, 2 by 3 can cancel. So what do you get? 2 into 8 to the power 3 by 2 is equal to 8. Or you get 8 to the power 3 by 2 is 8 by 2, it is 4. Or 8 is or a is 4 to the power 2 by 3. And that is my answer. So here also the calculation was simple the main thing was understanding the equation you have this curve and you have this line x is equal to 4 you got this bigger area and you say that there is a line x is equal to a that divides this into two equal halves then you say a1 is equal to a2 since a1 is equal to a2 a1 by a2 is equal to a2 by 2 because we can easily find a1 by 2 and a2 by 2 this area right so we found a1 by 2 this area correct a1 by 2 is nothing but you can say that area of f, if I put the value, this guy is O, this guy is as P, Q, R, S, right? So my A1 by 2 is nothing but the area of O, P, Q, this guy is P, right? O, P, Q, O, P, Q. And A2 by 2 is nothing but this area, that is P, Q, R, S. I think with this, your doubt must be clear. So you have a1 by 2, you have a2 by 2, you found the value. You equate this because they are equal given in the question. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.